So more Americans are adding a little cash to their wallets by working one, two, or even three mm. side jobs. But besides the extra funds, the question we're asking is, is the extra stress worth it? For your money this morning, our Barrett Leone looked at both sides of side hustles. From delivery services to dog sitting to driving, the possibilities to make extra cash are endless. Whatever I can do to, <laughs> to make a little extra money. But time, that's limited. My main job is 37 and a half hours a week. And then my side jobs are between probably 15 to 30, anywhere in there. That adds up quick. Yeah, it does. <laughs> So why the hustle? While the obvious is a pad in the income, the motivation changes. My secondary job gives me my purpose. I love it. I, I'm, I'm a busy man. I, I, gotta, I can't sit still. Money basically surviving and wanting nicer things. I feel like the income is needed. Nearly half of working Americans have a side gig. And of those hustlers, 41% say they need the extra money to make ends meet. But it can be a lot to manage. It has been the best thing that I ever did. But it took colored pens and a huge day planner to do that. <laughs> and despite that, these hustlers actually say working multiple jobs is good for their mental health, at least most of the time. It is challenging just to stay on top of all of it and to make sure that you're finding time for yourself. Minneapolis-based therapist Brenna McGee calls it a balancing act. I think everyone's dealing with some aspect of burnout right now. And suggests passing on an opportunity if it's not something you want to wholeheartedly say yes to. It's important to hold boundaries and know what we're saying no to, but to also be really clear on the why that we're saying yes to things. Barrett Leone, WCCO 4 News. So if this inspires you to start a side gig to make some extra cash, we have some tips on how to do so at WCCO.com.